This is my uh, BMC Time Machine TM01. It's the bike where I'm doing all my races with as I'm doing a triathlon long distance. So it's always with a time trial bike. I'm riding the bike for a couple of years now and uh, always in a similar setup. And it's just a, a bike where I feel really comfortable on. And uh, yeah, thanks to all the, all the good parts. I'm also really picky with all my, uh, all my stuff and my race setup. So I want everything like perfect, uh, clean, neat, uh, quite as aero as possible. So I did a lot of uh, work to, uh, to find the perfect setup. And I think like, uh, like this setup is the one that I, uh, the best one that I ever used. Yeah, what's so great about the bike is, uh, first of all, the, the DI2. I think it's uh, just amazing to use the DI2, especially on a TT bike, it's, uh, it's even better because you can shift in the two positions, in the aero bars and uh, just on the normal handlebars. So I think that's the big advantage over the mechanical shifting. One of the most important things for us uh, triathletes is to feel really comfortable in the aero position. And um, so we have the, the pro handlebar, the pro uh, missile. You have so many different setups, but uh, the more options you have, the easier it is to, to find uh, your perfect setup. And since this year I started uh, using the ski band, it's a bit more relaxed in the arms. And uh, I think this way I also went really narrow with the, with the arms. Also just to have that little bit extra, a bit more aero. But uh, since racing the ski band, uh, yeah, I'm surprised with how comfortable you can be in a narrow and low position. This is the bike uh, with the Ironman Hawaii race setup. In Ironman Hawaii, we are not allowed to uh, use a disc wheel on the back uh, because of the windy conditions. So that's why I'm using the C75 and the C50 in front. I think uh, the C50 is in front is just, uh, you know, in every condition, it's a safe wheel. Uh, the C75 might be a little bit more aero, but uh, with the crosswinds, it's always a bit more tricky. So for me, the main thing is to stay in the aero position. So uh, I prefer the C50 uh, in, the, in the windy conditions. And then uh, when, it, when it's possible on a fast course uh, or when it's, when it's allowed, I always uh, use the disc wheel. I saw the, the advantage of the disc wheel, even on uh, hilly races. Uh, it doesn't matter too much, the weight is not too much higher and, uh, and I think it's just uh, on the fast flat sections, the downhills, it's, it's a big advantage to have the disc. But in the, the most important race, it's not allowed in Ironman Hawaii, so that's why I have the Ironman Hawaii set up with me now. I think this is uh, my dream bike, my dream setup. Uh, through the years I changed a couple of things, but uh, you always try to make it a little bit better. And, and every year you think this is the best bike I can have and then you always find something new and or you try to find something new but uh, at the moment i'm really happy with uh, my bike with the gear and uh, and with the setup and i think for triathlon uh, yeah it's really important to feel comfortable on a fast bike <laughs>